cube. You can solve this starting on either end. Um, personally, I'm going to start on this end. I think it just goes together a little bit easier, especially near the end. If you start on the end that has three and then two, as opposed to the other one has um, a three and then three and then three. So we're going to start on this end here, and I'll show you basically the way that we would solve it with this. You want to start off with this um, three piece being down, so lying on the ground. And then we're going to have these two line up like this. And our third section, we're actually going to twist sideways so that it's coming right up at you. And our next one is going to go down beside that. So what you have here, whoops, in this way, there is the start to this puzzle. So you've got the first section, three, then two, and then we've got these two uprights. And those three, if you can kind of picture this, that's the, the center of the cube. The cube is gonna be three by three by three. And so from this point on, all we're basically going to do is take what's left of this and just wrap it around these two upright um, pieces. So I'm going to start here and I twisted that sideways. And now uh, I had a three piece go along there. A three piece will go along here. I'm gonna have to do a little bit of twisting with this. Um, let's see, where's the rope? Oh, there we go. So that goes over to there and then over again. I'm going to turn the things down so again, we are wrapping around. Wrapping and wrapping. The whole thing is all about wrapping around those, those two center pieces. So there's the full solution for putting together the snake cube puzzle. It's part of our three-in-one wooden box set. If you found that helpful, the link to purchasing this is below, and I'll also recommend some other puzzles you might like if you found that one fun, helpful, or something that is of interest to you. Have a wonderful day.